Hello everyone, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up Instagram shop. So the first thing we need to do is simply open up Facebook. Alright, once we're here, what we can do is go to the see more right here. And then we go to our pages. And then take note uh, that this will not work. Uh, you cannot set up Instagram shop if you do not have a page. So once again... You cannot create an Instagram shop without a page on Facebook. So once we're here, let's say I'll choose this one. <clears throat> that is the uh, page that I created for the sake of this video. And then once we're here, we just we can go here and we can go to uh, uh, professional. But uh, I won't do that. I will just go here to Meta Business Suite since it's on the shortcut right here in more tools. On the left hand side so we just click on meta business suite and then once we're here in meta business suite what we can do is go to our uh, inbox and as you can see uh, in the meta business suite we have our not notifications our ad managers uh, inbox content planner ads insights and ai tools i mean all tools so uh what you want to do now is go to inbox <clears throat> Oh, and if you're wondering how to create a page on Facebook, a little side note here, what you can do is go here down down here, go to pages again, and then we can what we can do is go to create new profile or page. So um, it is up to you if it's a personal profile or a public page. So I'll go with a uh, public page and then get started. And then once you're here in the page name, we just I'll just I'll type whatever. And then category, home decor maybe, and the bio is optional. You don't need to type in your bio. All you need to do is simply go to create page once you're satisfied with that. And then here is the mobile preview. And yeah, that is how you create a page on Facebook. So once we're done with that, you just you just leave it out there. And then once we're here back here in, in the inbox here in the meta suite, okay. I'll just do that again. So I go here in Meta Business Suite. Okay, right there. And then we go down to Inbox. Yeah. And then once we're here in Inbox, uh, what you can do is go to Instagram. And as you can see, it says connect to Instagram to get more features. To reach more of your community, connect your Facebook page or professional Instagram account. If you connect a personal Instagram account, it will be switched to professional. So what you can do is go to connect Instagram right here. And what, uh, what I can do is create a new Instagram profile or I can log into Instagram. So here it asks you to choose Instagram manage set message settings. So what you need to do is allow access to Instagram messages inbox. Uh, so what we can do is go click on continue and then it will ask me to log in. You might not see this right now, but it will ask you to log in. And wait for it to load. I'm logging into Instagram right now. Let's wait a minute. And then I will log in as my account right here. And so right here it asks me what best which best describes you. So I'm uh, since we're setting up an Instagram shop, uh, we're gonna click on business and then click on next. And then maybe music the grocery store maybe or a personal blog or product or service <clears throat> and then continue i'll switch to a business account and then wait for that to load a bit and then we'll ask me for my information and then once we have our instagram uh, loaded right here Okay, 
uh, what we can do is go to, go to home. Oh, I mean all tools. And then once we have our Instagram connected already, and as you can see, uh, it is connected. Uh, what we can do is, um, there's a lot of things we can do. Uh, for example, we can go to all tools and we can now um, engage with our audience, uh, create content, manage our inbox, manage the lead center, live dashboard, page posts, planner, sound collection, and then name the analyze report. We can get a uh, creative reporting, experiments, insights, better brand collapse manager, traffic analysis report, and uh, the two most important parts are the manage and sell products and services. So here in manage, what we can, what we can do is manage our apps right here. Okay, we'll need a two-factor authentication for that. And we can also manage our billing and payments. So right here, what we can do is uh, choose our account. <clears throat> and then what we can do is manage our uh, payment account. So in our payment activity, we, have, we can also see it here. Uh, and then in what we can also see here is our brand rights protection, our brand safety and sustainability, and in business apps, collaboration center, business support home, file manager, and in the sell and products and services, what we, uh, what we can do now is to set up our Instagram shop is click on commerce. With my both on my uh, Facebook page and my Instagram account. So what we can do is go down to all tools, go down to sell products and services, go to commerce. But then what we can do is just get started. Click on next, done. So what we can do is add account. And just click on next. Uh, for example, I don't use any of these platforms. Just gonna choose Philippines, which is my country. Oh, this is not available. So I'm just gonna choose uh, maybe Shopify until I see that it is available in my country. And no, that does not seem to work. So maybe I'll just go back here, add account. And once I click on next, it will ask me for a URL. Uh, I don't have one yet, but uh, it's pretty straightforward from here on out. Uh, just add your uh, URL and then shipping returns and preview. And that is it. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking and subscribing.